Hey guys, so today I have a MAC and NARS dupe video. Mostly MAC and only one NARS dupe, so I'm just going to jump right into it. Most of the products I don't have the same thing of, but I just want to let it out there to tell you guys that this is what I've heard are dupes for, so I'm just going to swatch them for you, and some of them I have the products for, and I can show you how, <clears throat> sorry, how alike they are. So, I'm just going to start with the lipsticks I have. Um, this one is Revlon Soft Nude, and it looks like this. It's just a really nice nude color, and this is a dupe for Max Creme de Nude. And I'm just going to swatch it right here. It's such a nice creamy nude color. It's beautiful. So that is the swatch for Creme de Nude. Well, not Creme de Nude. That's the dupe for it, and this one is in Soft Nude by Revlon. And it's the quilted packaging, and it's just a very nice... Um, really pigmented nude color. Then another lipstick is also by Le Revlon and this one is in Pink Pout and it's a matte formula and it looks like this and this is a dupe from Max Angel and I will swatch that right there and it looks like that and it's beautiful and it's just really really pretty. It's a great matte pink color. So that is a dupe for Max Angel Revlon Pink Pout. Then this Maybelline eyeshadow in Champagne Fizz is a dupe for Max Grand Entrance. Looks like that. And I will swatch it. That's the swatch on my finger. And that is the swatch on my hand. And then, another Maybelline eyeshadow in Silken Taupe is a dupe from NARS's Ashes to Ashes eyeshadow. So I will swatch that. Looks like that. And this is the swatch. It's very sheer. I don't know if you'll be able to see that color. It's right there. It's very, very sheer. And it looks like that. So, that is that. And the last eyeshadow I don't have a, a MAC or a NARS eyeshadow for is this Wet n Wild Color Icon Color in Brulee. And it looks like this. And I love this as a highlight. I use it every day. It's matte. And... It's very pigmented, but it's so light that it blends into my skin. It looks like that, and it's a great under-the-brow bone highlight. I love it. Alright, let me go get a little wipe, so I can wipe my little fingers off and my hand off. Alright, now that we are getting clean, um, <clears throat> the next set of swatches I have... MAC eyeshadows for. So, this Wet n Wild Color Icon eyeshadow is in Nutty, and this is a dupe for MAC Satin Taupe, and I will swatch Satin Taupe next to Nutty. So, this is Nutty, very pigmented. I will swatch that for you. Looks like that. And I love this stuff. And then this is Satin Taupe. And I'll put Satin Taupe right next to it. Looks like that. They both are very much the same, but, um, what's it called? Satin Taupe is a little bit more pigmented, so if you build this up, it'll look identical. So those are, this is Satin Taupe and this is Nutty next to it. Then I have... Um, alright, let's see. Where is that one? Oh my god, I lost it! Oh, here we go. Alright, let's find my palette that I have this in. Um, not that one, and not this one. I have three full MAC eyeshadow palettes that I need to, like, rummage through. Anyway, so this is another Wet n' Wild, um, color icon color, and this one is in Penny. And it looks like this, and this is a dupe for Max Coppering. So I'm just going to swatch this, and it's very pigmented as well. 
So that's Max, Pen not Mac, um, Wet n Wild's Penny eyeshadow. And this is Coppering. Coppering is a little bit more red and orange, but Penny's a little bit more pink. But honestly, you won't be able to tell the difference on the eyes, so they are very, very similar. Okay, so let us move on and wipe my hand off. Um, Alright, the next group of eyeshadows that I will be swatching is in the CoverGirl Golden Sunset Eyeshadow Trio. And I will, I only have a dupe for two of them. So the middle one is a dupe for Amber Lights. So I'm going to swatch that for you. And right here. So that is the middle color in the Golden Sunset CoverGirl Trio. And Amber Lights is right there. Those are really nice dupes for each other. I identical, practically. So, this one is Max Amber Lights, and this one is in the CoverGirl Golden Sunset Trio. The middle color. And then, also from the same trio, the last color right here, this really nice golden yellow color, I'm going to swatch that for you. And I'm going to swatch that right here. Swatch that right there, and then... This is Max Dream Maker eyeshadow. I'm gonna swatch it right next to it, and they are pretty much the same. So that is pretty much a really nice dupe. So you can have two Mac eyeshadow dupes in one palette, and I believe this is like five dollars and a really nice brown color. So good palette to pick up, and. If you were wondering, this is Max Dream Maker eyeshadow, and this is Max um, Amber Lights eyeshadow and Coppering eyeshadow. All right, and the next palette I have is the Shimmering Sands um, CoverGirl eyeshadow trio, and I only have a dupe for one of them, and I believe it's in this palette. Yes. I have a dupe for this pink color right here, so I'm going to swatch that for you, and I shall, I'll wipe these off for you, so you can see them nice and up close. Alright, I'll swatch that right here. So that's the pink color, and this color right here is floof, so that is going to be the dupe for um, that eyeshadow. And those are them next to each other, and I think they are great dupes for each other. And even if the other two are not any MAC dupes that I found, at least, um, these, this is a great trio to pick up because you can make an everyday look out of this palette, and everyone loves this palette. So... I believe that that is all the dupes I have for you guys today. I'm still going to be picking up more stuff to make more dupe videos. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed this. If you do, please like the video and comment below. And thank you to all my subscribers. Thanks for watching and please subscribe. Bye guys.